Consumers Energy is constructing the company's first large-scale solar project. Today, a ceremonial groundbreaking was held in Muskegon County as work gets underway. News 8's Demetria Sanders shows us how the new facility will help customers and the community. As Consumers Energy moves away from coal, leaders with the company say that this project in Moreland Township will be a big step forward in their transition to clean energy. One, two, three. Shovels of dirt have been turned, marking construction of the Muskegon Solar Energy Center in Moreland Township. Really, really excited about the fact that this has all come to fruition now and has come to fruition with a state-of-the-art project. The solar energy farm is being built on 1,900 acres of land at the Muskegon County Resource Recovery Center. When completed, the 250 megawatt facility will generate enough electricity to power nearly 40,000 homes across the state. 30 to 35 years we'll have this facility. In fact, after 25 years, it'll still produce 80% of the power it produces on day one. A few years back, Consumers Energy committed to a clean energy future, and this is the first utility-scale project to come from that process. Your mix of resources that you use to, that, for the electricity that you use in your homes and businesses, that will change. That mix will change over time to become much greater amounts of solar, wind, and non other non-carbon resources. And Hicks says lower and more stable energy prices come with that. When you're, when you're burning coal or you're burning natural gas, to produce electricity, you've got to pay for that fuel. And that, that price is volatile. So we know what the cost of the fuel for this solar project is going to be for the next 30 to 35 years. It's going to be zero. I'm looking forward to the continued partnership. Muskegon County officials also looking forward to the project in their community. We used to have the cob plant. You know, the cob plant got shut down. Well, this is an awesome replacement because now we're getting that energy source back. Nash says the county is leasing the property, which is usually used for crops to consumers. Payments from the utility company, as well as property taxes, is expected to bring in money. What we make in crops, we're, we're getting more than enough from them to take care of that expense so we're not losing anything and we're gaining a little bit of revenue on top of that. And with a goal to bring 8,000 megawatts of solar online by 2040, the project is the first of many. We're going to have to have 31 more Muskegons in the state in order to meet our clean energy transition goals. The Solar Energy Center is expected to be operational in 2026. In Moreland Township, Demetria Sanders, News 8.